This is the call to Isan, the call to perfection, the call to let our inner faith show forth outwardly through our deeds and actions. The call to Isan in West Africa began more than 20 years ago. It began with a small group of people who asked the question, how can we make a difference in the lives of the people of West Africa? With the answer to that question, Isan Foundation was born. Over the past 20 years, Isan has reached for those in need through the many services it provides. Education, health care, humanitarian projects, emergency relief, support for widows and orphans, skills training, farmers assistance, building masjids, schools, community centers, clinics, and health centers, all in pursuit of its goal of creating educated, healthy, sustainable, and peaceful societies in West Africa. Whether providing support to widows and orphans after a civil war, or delivering disaster relief after an horrific mudslide, whether digging wells to provide life-sustaining water to a village that has none, or giving assistance to farmers so that they can become self-sufficient, whether building schools to provide an education that these children would not otherwise have access to, or building masjids so that a believing community can have a place to worship together. Our methods are always the same. See a need and fill it. Build relationships with donors like you, with governments and municipalities, with like-minded organizations doing good works, and build institutions that will nurture the communities we serve into the future. This is the work that supporters like you have helped us to carry on for the last 20 years. Impacting the lives of more than 200,000 people across nine countries. The work of Isan. Touching lives. Making a difference. On Monday morning, August 14th, 2017, people living in Freetown, Sierra Leone, awoke to torrential rain, floods, and a mudslide that buried entire areas of the town carrying off property, houses, and people. 499 people, including 150 children, were killed. Hundreds were buried in the rubble, and more went missing. Many residents of Freetown lost their homes and their entire families. Close to 20,000 people, 5,000 of them children, have been displaced by the disaster. In the days immediately following, Isan Foundation's team was on the ground, consoling survivors and assessing their emergency needs. They gave out food, blankets, clothing, and cash. In the following weeks, Isan, along with its international partners, was able to distribute food, clothing, 
household goods, and hundreds of mattresses to survivors living in makeshift and temporary housing. The Holy Prophet Muhammad wasallam, said that the most beloved of deeds, according to Allah the Mighty, the Magnificent, is that you bring happiness to a fellow Muslim, or relieve him of distress, or pay off his debt, or stave away hunger from him. And this is exactly what you did with the gifts that you donated to those in need in Sierra Leone. Your gifts traveled to the north, the south, the east, and the west. They traveled through paved highways, rough jungle roads, and even over water to reach island communities in need. Isan's years of service to the people of Sierra Leone laid the groundwork that made this widespread distribution possible. Building institutions, and serving the needs of the people. The gifts were received with clamoring, with great joy, with prayers, with dancing and with song. But overwhelmingly, your gifts were received with great appreciation. The gifts included money, blankets, hijabs, bicycles, a laptop, a sewing machine, books, and even knitting yarn. Muhammad Mansureh lost his home in the flood. Now, because of your gift of money, he has a roof over his head. The blankets were given mostly to the elderly, particularly to women. The bikes were gifted to orphans who had to walk long distances to get to school. To a teacher who had to travel to a remote village to teach and another who sells medicine on the side to supplement his income. The laptop was given to Muhammad, one of our orphans who just entered college. The sewing machine will help this gentleman to get back on his feet and take care of his family. We received so many books from the Muslim Community Association and the Granada Islamic School in Santa Clara that some will be donated to one of our schools and the rest we will use to establish a small Granada library. Already in its third decade of existence, Isan continues to need your support and generosity. Every masjid that you build, every school or clinic that you establish, each child that you put through school, each orphan that you sponsor, each farmer that you support, each sick person that your generosity heals, each devastated community that you help, each well that you offer to a needy community, is contributing to Hassan's vision of a new West Africa, enlightened, peaceful, and self-reliant. Thank you for being our partners. Thank you for your generosity. And may Allah reward you abundantly.